Are you tired of burning fossil fuels to produce electricity in your block world? Well, I have something to show you. Wind generators! Now, using your digital miner, you can strip all the resources out of the ground without burning fuel. It's completely clean and efficient. And don't worry about the resource cost because they'll continuously produce electricity. Yeah. If you can't tell, today's episode is going to be Mechanism. Yo, what's up guys? I'm back here with another episode and today we're going to be working on some mechanism. As you can see, I got some mechanism set up. This, I'm recording this later, but yeah, we're going to be working on some mechanism and yeah, hope you enjoy. Okay, so actually, wait, I need to get some food. Okay, so I got some, some steel now. So now that I got some steel, I should be able to make the machines. I actually made a lot of steel and now I'm kind of low on coal. But in the cave, I have a bunch of unmined coal bins, so yeah. Um, yeah, I got my steel in my inventory, so now let's look at the, um... Okay, my mind just went blank. Let's look at the... Let me just search mechanism. The enrichment chamber? Yeah, this thing. Okay, so let's see. I need four glass and osmium. Crap, I don't have osmium. That's not very good. Um, still wasn't very prepared. Um, yeah. So, that's not the right cast. Ah. Uh, okay, so let me just put that out. So, I need the glass. I have exactly enough glass. Let me actually start smelting up some more of that. Just for later um yeah and let's see what else do i need i need some wait what okay well before i need the metallurgic infuser first yeah that looks more obtainable okay so redstone osmium a couple of furnaces actually let me just grab a stack a couple of Furnaces, um, a couple of redstone, four iron. Yeah, have that in my inventory, and then I'll start pouring this out. And I should just need one osmium for this. Okay, so I have my osmium, and I can make the metallurgic infuser now. So I just attach that to the power cable. Oh. Okay. Actually, I want to attach it here. Because, yeah, I usually like to have my uh, enrichment, my enrichment chamber before that. So, yeah. Uh, so now that I have, actually, now I'll put this first. Uh, so now that I have the metallurgic infuser, I'm going to need, let's see, no, not those. I don't want to deal with rubber right now. Um. Basic control circuit, so that'll re require one redstone and one osmium. So I'm gonna need two redstone and two osmium. Also, the smeltery glitched, and there was emeralds in there, so I just broke it and put the emeralds back, and just gave myself an em emerald or whatever. And let's see. Okay, so we have enough osmium, and now I have my two redstone. Let's see, that'll give me twenty, and then there. Now let me make the machine casing. And steel casing, just like that. And now I need four more redstone and those two circuits. All right, I I'm glad I did a bunch of mining and stuff because now I actually have the resources to do this stuff. Oh, and also I should probably put some more coal. I actually took the coal out and like used it um, just so that it wasn't like wasting any, but now I'm using machines. Oof, rest in peace, bouge. Rest in peace. Here, you want to take a sword along? Here, just take this sword along. Um. Yeah, okay, so now I need... I think I can craft this thing. No, wait, I just crafted it. What am I doing? Okay, so I have my enrichment chamber now. And... 
are this is there a mechanism quest line? Mechanism, mechanism, mechanism. No, there it doesn't look like there is. Okay, so I have the enrichment chamber and kinda wanna spread this down. Okay, let me grab some dirt. Okay. With the power of placing a bunch of blocks, I can increase the size of my land. Yay. Perfect. Um, okay, I don't really want that, so just put in there. Eat. Okay, so now I want a furnace or smelting factory. Basic smelting factory, so that'll require a couple more. And actually, this time I'm going to make eight. Um, because I can turn one redstone, and then I can enrich it, and then that'll give me a compressed redstone, which will equal eight. So it's really, it's really good. That's why I wanted to get that fast. And so now I want the basic smelting factory. I have enough iron. I just need four more redstone. And. Wait, oh, I just needed a. Some glass. Glasses in this furnace. And so I don't want that. I just want the energized smelter. Now let's see. I can make that. Now this should be finished. I can put that in there. That there. So now for all the other machines, I can just quickly um I can literally just quickly um I'll just have enough circuits to craft it, so I just need one more now, and yeah, we should be good to go, I think. Uh, yeah, I'm just missing that. Okay, cool. Yes, we got it. Alright. Okay, now that we have our energized, energized smelter, now making, uh, like, refining ores and stuff is going to be so much easier. I kind of want that torch there still. Okay, now refining all this stuff will be so much easier. Let's see. Just put it all in there. Alright. Because I don't have to like deal with like the smeltery and everything and it going really slowly. I, I can just like. Let me, let me actually show you with some iron because I'm going to need some iron. So I got 20 iron put in the arrangement chamber. I can even set auto eject and stuff. Input. Auto eject, and then that'll just automatically actually make me the iron. So yeah, that's actually really good. Um, so now you're asking, what am I gonna do with this? Well, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to make some wind generators. Let's see. Uh, all right, so I'm gonna need some enriched alloy. So I'm gonna make a couple. I'm gonna make like 16 of these. So, oh, okay. Well, I need to wait for that to get done. Um, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna, let me, I'm gonna just put this over here, and I'm gonna see, let's see, the solar generator. And then that one as well. Um, it's pretty easy, just some osmium dust as well, and I, can, I think I can just, uh, put that in the crusher. You know what, maybe I'll make a crusher while I'm waiting. Okay, so I need two lava buckets, so let me actually- I have a drum full of lava that I got, I made a iron drum. Iron drum can hold 256 buckets of any, um, any one fluid, so, um, so it, it only costs 17 iron. So 7, and then that adds up to 11, and then you add the 6. So, and it's actually really good, so now let me grab my other bucket here. And now I have those two buckets, and I wanted a crusher. Let's see, so that one. And another steel casing for redstone. Perfect. And I need to grab the rest. I don't want to be holding the lava bucket. It's making me he like nervous. Okay, so now that I have my crusher. Be good. Ah. Uh, 
create another layer of machines here. Just to maximize the usage of my cable. I think four is pretty good. Alright, I'm still I'm still really good on power actually, so it's not even burning through coal that fast. Um but I do want power to get like taken care of, so probably gonna build up high to use the wind generators maybe. I'm not really sure. I'm gonna see how like efficient it is and how many I really need. So let's see, these blue cables. Um wait, what? Oh yeah, I got these things. I don't know. I don't know what I was saying. Um so I'm actually trying to make all of my armor unbreakable. And so these ones are all good, and then these ones all have five modifiers, and this one has four. So I've been just like standing here, letting it take damage and then repairing it. So then I'll be able to make them all unbreakable, because you know what I really want to do? So basically, uh, my chest plate, I added this modifier that allows me to become invisible. It's uh, kind of tedious to get, but it's really good. So it's the base, the fermented spider eye, the golden carrot, eye vendor, potion of invisibility. And so basically if I press 2 on my number pad, uh, which is the keybind I manually set. I don't think, uh, there wasn't a manual keybind, and so, let's see. Yeah, now, now I'm just completely invisible, which I think is pretty cool. But it does use durability, so, yeah. Okay, is this done yet? Yes, okay, so now I can do that, and I need some of this iron. I'm going to need 16. That in there. Wait for that to finish. Okay, now that's finished. Boom. I really want to see what speed upgrades are actually going to cost. Uh, let's see. Speed upgrade. Um, couple enriched alloy. Osmium dust and a couple glass. That's actually pretty cheap. Mm. But that will cost more power, and I don't have good power yet. Let me just stick that in there, and that should be good. So, another thing, so, yeah, not another thing, uh, I got the pressure done. So now the wind generator, let's see. So, there's a spider up there. Uh, so some gold. Uh... Okay, I do have some, but, uh, you know what, I'm gonna melt these down as well. Because I, I don't really need all of this yet. Oh, I can't, I can't, are you kidding me? Okay, well those are just going to be stuck like that. It's kind of infuriating, but like, let's, let's see how much gold I really need. I think I'm going to make two of these, so that's 6, 12, so... No other gold required in the recipe? Yep. Alright, that's good. Oh, I made all these machines here? Yeah, so this it'll, this is a better ore doubling system here, and this is my power source. I'm working on uh, getting the uh, wind generator. Yeah. Haven't you been hearing me commentate? Uh, yeah, he's in a call, but he doesn't want the microphone, his microphone ruining like the video quality or whatever. So he's just not talking. So I got a block there and the three ingots. Ah, no, you have learned to tune me out. Alright, cool. Cool. Come on. Ah, okay, um... Yes, I think some of this stuff should be done. Yeah, some of that's done, so now... Okay, so basically... <laughs> okay, let me explain this. Or not. Okay. Um... Explain. Okay. So, this is what's producing all the power. It just eats up the coal and produces power. And then these are the cables that are transferring all the power. And so, this thing allows me to, like, convert, uh, like, iron, for example, and, like, redstone that I, like, stored in here. And into, like, this thing called the enriched alloy, which is used for crafting recipes. And then this thing will enrich things. Like, like for example, like, one iron ore will turn into two iron dust. Or... Yeah, pulverized iron, and then I have it automatically going into here, which will is just a, basically a furnace, but it's powered. It runs on power. So yeah. Um, now let me actually make this wind generator. I think I do have enough osmium. Hopefully, ah, oh, that's done. Let's see. Eight. Let's see. Make two of those. 
than that. Yes! I did it. Now let me just run some cable up with it. Just build out. Uh, maybe. I might join the truck call. Okay, that's not gonna work here. Um, let's see. I need this. Aw. Oh. Here, uh. I wanna build up so it's more efficient. There we go. Down. Let's see. And now I can plop this thing down here and it'll connect. Generating more than I'm using, that's good. Fall damage. Oh wait, no, I have the boots. Um Yo, can I have the sword back? Thank you. Okay, uh let me just put one of these buckets away. So now there's this I'll probably make it look better later or something. Uh but for now okay. Wait, that was your iron. I'm sorry, I just stole five of your iron. Um, yeah, okay, so, I, I was gonna make two of those, wasn't I? Oh, gonna have to build up there, yay, again. More redstone, eight more, to be exact. Okay, cool, boom, boom. Okay, and now, the real reason I wanted all this stuff is so I can get a digital mic. it normally. Wait, I can place it like this. Yes. Ah. Dang. Ah, right. Oh yes, I made it. I definitely planned that. Okay, um. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I wanted a digital miner. So what the digital miner, uh, oh, I'm gonna need some more diamonds? Wait, actually, let me calculate the cost of diamonds. Okay, so, atomic alloy, one diamond, that's two, and then I'm gonna need, so that would be three diamonds, let's see, yeah, okay, I can make all this stuff, yeah, I can make this stuff, yeah, Let's see, I'm gonna need two atomic, four atomic, six, no, five atomic, six, seven atomic, so the, so basically I need three diamonds for this. Oh, shoot. Oh. Okay, so I'm gonna need three diamonds. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna need three diamonds for this, but it's gonna be so worth it, dude. Alright, so first I can make a steel casing. Let's see, make that. Then let me just. Two redstone. Eight cobblestone. And six planks. Okay, um. Yeah, okay, so now I got those two things. Okay, uh, more gold. Okay, let's see, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do you happen to have any gold? More than one ingot? Yes, can I use your one gold ore? Yes. I think that's all I need. Oh no, it's not gonna be enough. Okay, um, well, that's not very epic. Um, but I can I can wait on that. I think, right? 
I just need that for that. Yeah. Okay, so now let me just see if I can make... Let's see if I need two chests. Okay, so I need two chests. And also, by the way, if you're wondering about this ender sack, I actually found it in a dungeon chest. Just like a random dungeon that I wasn't recording, but I found it. It didn't have that great a loot, but that's like one good thing that I found. Um, Yeah. Personalized chest for fine. Oh, I'm out of circuits. Okay, let me just grab that and then I need to. Ah! Refine some obsidian. I mean, not obsidian, osmium. Okay, I'll give him his iron. Okay. So. I think I, I'm gonna break this now. Or I guess I could have kept it around because it was like. Okay, I'll just leave it there because it's like it still has like 60,000 in it or whatever, but I want my coal out and I don't want it to be using coal. Um, so. Yeah, digital miner. Yay. I need this personal chest. Yeah. Okay, if this can finish quickly, that would be great. Maybe. Alright, actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like, get all the stuff ready and make sure I have all the resources, and then I'll do the prepping on camera. So, yeah, I'll be back. Okay, everyone, so, I am back. I got some of the resources. They're set up in the crafting tables. So, the first thing I'm gonna make is a... I forgot what this was, but I need these two advanced control circuits, and it's an osmium compressor, because I'm going to have to be dealing with a different resource that is going to require this. So, now that I have that, and I made some of these reinforced alloy, it's just diamond and enriched alloy. So, yeah, and let's see, so I'm going to need to enrich this obsidian, and then I'm going to put the obsidian in there. So I'm gonna come over here now, and I need to craft this personal chest, which was part of the recipe, like, right here. So I'm gonna need to craft that, and then put it here, put it here, um, and then I need to smelt up some gold, which I kind of forgot to do, uh, which I, I can just do really fast, so, where's my gold? How much do I need? I need four, ten. All right, I need ten gold, so five should be good, like that. And then, my, since my obsidian's done, I can put it in here, and that'll combine with the diamond and give me um, the the refined obsidian dust. And then that, that'll allow me to get the atomic alloys. So, let's see. I'm going to need two refined obsidian ingots. So that's going to mean that I need to put these in the osmium compressor along with two osmium ingots so that I will be able to get my two... So that I'll, I'll be able to get what I need. Um, so yeah. Let me see over here. Yeah, so this this will be the final thing. And the, these are like the things to craft the robot. Um, so I'm just waiting for this gold to finish up, and uh, I'm one short. For some reason, it always takes like a little bit more than it should, like so that you're always a little bit short the first time. Um, so now I just need the atomic alloy. Which I'm cooking up, so basically I need one of these. I'm going to enrich it so that I can make eight items out of it. Because otherwise it would just be one refined obsidian dust and one refined alloy for the um, atomic alloy. But now I can just compress it, or enrich it, and then I get the compressed obsidian. And I can put that in there, and then put that, and that'll melt, and then it'll, that'll combine. And I'm just waiting for that now. And by the way, this is all being run off just the two wind generators. There's nothing left in here anymore. It's just all empty. So, yeah. 
so, and it, I haven't had any power issues, so uh, the two, it's pretty cheap as well, so the two um, wind generators are perfect. And what else did I need in here for the teleportation cores? Oh, I needed the atomic alloy. Alright, so now that I have that, I have my two energy tablets. I can put those there. And now, basically, all I need is these atomic alloys. And I see uh, Dabouge following me around. So, yeah. One more. <laughs> this is funny. Okay, so now that I have these, put those there. Now I just need two more and the robot, which means I all I need is three more of these atomic. Alright, I need one more. Yes, and I will have... <laughs> and, and then I'll have the digital miner. And it's going to be amazing. And I'm going to have to make more wind generators, probably. But, yeah. Okay, let me put that there. That there. There. And I have the digital miner! Yes! Look at this thing. It's ridiculous. Looks like that. It has power. So, silk touch, config. I'm gonna add in like all the ores. What? What do you mean it's a pig? Okay. Um, so I'm actually going to craft a chest for this. Wait, one sec. Uh, I need to craft a storage crate for this thing. Storage crates are always a necessity because they're so overpowered. Need my four chests. And there we go. I got my small storage crate. I can just plop that right here. And yeah, this is receiving power, so this should be good. And what happens if I just start it? It doesn't run to mine anything. Okay, so. So I'm going to get some. So let's see. I want. I'm gonna let me empty out my inventory real quick, actually. Okay. So I set up all the filters and um. Yeah, I set up all the filters and I'm gonna start it. Ten thousand blocks and it's using way too much power. What the? Gotta be. How much power is this thing using? Tell me. What do you mean all as well? Auto eject on. Let's reset this and turn off self touch maybe. Now it can sustain power. Yes, it's sustaining the correct amount of power. Never mind. Okay, so I think I'm gonna just put a button. I don't need speed. I want energy upgrades in this thing. Energy upgrade. Let's see. So I need. I'm gonna. So you can put eight of these. So I'm gonna need eight pulverized gold. Let me just clear all this stuff out. Okay, so I'm gonna need eight pulverized gold and sixteen glass and sixteen of those circuit things, those enriched alloys. Okay, so let me just pulverize the gold real quick. Just if I can turn off auto eject and that'll just stay in there and yeah. See, like that, like that, like that. So I want to be able to run this with silk touch, so it'll be more efficient. So, yeah, I don't want to. I want to be able to like silk touch the stuff I really want. I mean, not silk touch. I want to be able to uh, fortune the stuff I really want. So yeah. Okay, one more. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Oh, there's still an atomic alloy in here. That's pretty cool. Forgot about that. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna need to start uh, looking at like storage systems. I think I'm gonna go with fine storage just because I don't have to deal with the channels and they're both available in one time. I can't shift right click. Oh, come on. Usually you can like shift right click something, but now I'll just slowly add them. Yes. Let's see how efficient it actually gets. It's gonna be crazy. Is it gonna be how long? 
Is it gonna be ten times more efficient? Yes, it's ten times more efficient. Maybe I can still touch now. Maybe. Oh yes, I can still touch. Wait, maybe. That one's gaining. Now that that one's full, this one's still losing power. Um. Huh. This one's stable. Now this one's stable. Is this one power 31? Power 31. Okay. So it doesn't matter which direction they're facing. Huh. Okay. Well, I mean, it's stable and it's mining blocks. So that's pretty cool. Yo, bourgeois. Since you helped. You, 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 uh, helped. Uh, yeah. You, you get, you get some of the ores. Okay, everyone. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And. The items were, retor were, were returned back to me. And also something that I figured out that I just want to show you guys real quick is that you can, so let me just stop this real quick. Under the config, you can just press ore and then the asterisk, asterisk, and it'll mine every single ore. So you don't have to go in and enter them manually. So yeah, I don't know why there's a hang glider there, but yeah. All right. Thank you all for watching. Subscribe if you enjoyed, leave a like, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.